Hello and welcome to this video of the 2022 Marx 330 Scandinavia World Chorus which is offered for sale here in Porto Poenza, Mallorca. Please check out the video and have a look through the yacht's features with us, we'd be delighted to help with any queries. Wild Chorus was delivered by Berthen towards the end of 22 and has been lightly used by her owners in Porto Polenza. Stepping on board the Marex 330, you have the large extended swimming platform which on this boat has been labelled Teak. You have a bathing ladder to starboard and an opening locker in the bathing platform deck. This boat has also been upgraded with the transom seat where the transom shower is also located with hot and cold water. On the 330 you have wide safe decks which crucially are not asymmetrical and the same generous width on both sides. Within the side deck you have deep fender lockers on both port and starboard. Around the aft cockpit you have this quality teak rail which is upgraded with dimmable LED lights which look fantastic at night. There is also a closing transom gate which adds to the feeling of safety on board, particularly if you have children. This large aft sofa design is very much part of the Marex DNA where you always have comfortable curved corners and generous backrests. The quality teak table also opens up and it drops down to make a sun pad. Around the cockpit, Marex have designed a super fast canopy system, which allows you to draw the canopy in seconds with dedicated rails. There is also a large sunroof, which can be quickly opened or closed. Looking forward, we enter the cockpit saloon with the closing doors which have been upgraded with an integral mosquito screen. Looking back in the cockpit, there is plenty of storage and the lockers are designed so that you don't need to remove the cockpit cushions when opening the lid. Here in the cockpit saloon, to port we have the sofa with a converting table and excellent all round views. The table drops down to make us a further berth and the forward bench converts to a co-pilot seat. There are plenty of handrails, a clever organiser and an opening side window to port. The ergonomic helm position is finished in a Nextel anti-glare finish. There is also a very comfortable pilot chair with bolster and well-appointed dashboard. The helm station on this boat has been upgraded with two 12-inch Simrad chart plotters which fully interface with the McCruiser engines. You also have analogue engine instrumentation and fusion stereo. Here at the helm we have a chain counter, rocker switches for the main systems, bow thruster, joystick docking control, VHF and AIS, throttles and of course on this boat you have the opening side door to starboard allowing the helm to have direct access to the side deck or foredeck. And below the helm we have the battery level indicators. The galley is positioned after the helm and offers huge amounts of storage. There is a sink with mixer tap and two fridges.
There is also a gas oven and hob. In terms of accommodation, the Marek's 330 is very clever and offers two proper cabins and a separate shower compartment. In the cabins, you have large panoramic windows and in the forward cabin, there's a large central berth with a huge top stowing storage locker. The cabins on this boat are also both air conditioned and heated via a separate system. Here to port there is a hanging locker and light panels in the deck head. The shower compartment is of course well appointed and we have an electric heads and separate shower with plenty of headroom. The aft cabin has lots of height as you enter and a full beam berth. There is plenty of storage close to the windows on both sides. Now heading up the side deck, there are lots of handrails which really add to the feeling of security. And here you can see the garage for the canopy. On this boat you also have a four deck sun pad, which actually floats if launched into the water. The boat has also been specified with teak on the side decks and there is an electric windlass which can be controlled together with the bow thruster by remote or from the helm station. Here we can also see the forward large opening sunroof and it's worth noting that this boat has also been fitted with solar panels which charge up the service batteries. She has also been fitted with radar. Wild Chorus is fitted with the popular twin Macruza 270 horsepower diesel engines, which offer great performance and manoeuvrability. There is plenty of space in the engine room, and these engines come with a joystick docking system, digital anchor feature, and autopilot as standard. This boat was also recently upgraded at a great expense with lithium batteries and upgraded electronic equipment. This allows you to run the air conditioning and other systems for long extended periods without the need for a generator or short power. <laughs>